Welcome to another travel edition of Great Health, Abundant Happiness, and Outrageous Love. Morning, honey. Good morning, sweetheart. We are at the Hilton Logan Boston Airport Hotel, I believe. Yeah, it's a Hilton here, and a uh, beautiful view of Boston right out there. So we're over here at the airport, if you guys know this view. Yeah. Glimmering city there, gorgeous day. Can't wait to get out there. Beautiful day. Um, this hotel is the only hotel that is physically connected to the airport. So for location, especially for uh, a travel day like yesterday, where our flight was supposed to arrive at 10, and I believe we checked in here sometime around 2 a.m., um, the location on a one to five is a five plus. Just not having to, you know, worry about going anywhere or finding the hotel. It was attached. Now with that said, you can only get to it from two different terminals. Um, so they gave me a 24 hour number uh, to call the shuttle to bring us to the front door. And he was there waiting for us by the time we got off the plane and we didn't have check bags. So that was really stupendous as well. So service, I also had a one to five, I give it a five. And the lady who checked us in at two in the morning was surely way more chipper than we felt. And again, the service, the people, everything she detailed with the room um, on a one to five, I give a five. We were absolutely exhausted. So I'm pretty sure we would have slept on anything, but as you know, we are very particular about the comfort of the beds. Again, I have not stayed in a Hilton um, Jeffrey, we haven't been in the Hilton in, in like a decade. Well, it's been a while because we, we do a lot of uh, Bonvoy and Hyatt, and right? And Hyatt. Yeah. Um, but we, um, and we also have the same status that we have at those that at Hilton. We just, for some reason, don't usually choose that. And I think that is going to change now because we had such a great experience. And this is a, you know, I don't want to call it a low-end hotel because it's actually a lovely hotel but it's not a vacation spot this is where you come and you spend a night um you know coming and going when you're traveling um but the bed was so comfortable the pillows were amazing just the right squishiness for me i don't know if jeffrey likes a little foamier but um no it's great yeah. I, I slept like a rock I you think did I, I think I he was sound asleep. asleep um immediately so um i on a one to five i give the bed a five Cleanliness, the room was immaculate. I mean, I don't have a complaint there. I'm looking at the side view of the TV, which is always one of the big telltales. There's not a fingerprint on it. It's clean, there's not a speck of dust on it. It's super, super clean. They really took some time and care to make sure that they cleaned top to bottom here. So cleanliness of five as well. Um, I love that they had water waiting in the refrigerator, which she let us know upon check-in. And, um, you know, it's just very efficient. Full length mirror, small closet. And then Jeffrey, just a quick peek. The bathroom's pretty small, um, but it was, again, immaculate. And do you care about anything else except a clean bathroom when you check in? Exactly. That's it. So um, as far as where I would stay next time, and we've been to just about every hotel around this airport, um, there's a, a Hyatt that's not far, as well as plenty of Marriott's that aren't far. I'm gonna say that the Hilton is going to be my choice. And not again because there's anything spectacular. It was more so it, it suited the need of getting a great night's sleep. It was so quiet. And as you can see, we're right off the highway. If these shades are drawn, you would have no idea. So again, for quietness, it was zero, one to five. Uh, I'm sorry, one to five, five. I'm not working on a lot of sleep here. <laughs> anyway, that's You're it for today. Too. We give this place a thumbs up and yes, we'll return. This is the Hilton at Boston Logan Airport, wishing you great health, abundant happiness, and outrageous love from Boston, Mass. Next challenge is to go get that uh, rental car, which rental cars are scarce here. So we're driving up to, to Uber and up to Revere. But great, uh, great day, as you can see. Boston's expanding out there. It's amazing what they're doing in the seaport. Great place to visit. Thanks for watching.